Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Squall, and if you don't know who I am, I do Windows 8 reviews, tutorials. I also do gaming, such as The Walking Dead, Call of Duty, Minecraft. Uh, hopefully soon I'll get to the Amnesia. I've got it on here. I haven't played it yet, but uh, some people say it's a pretty good game, so I'll have to check that out soon. Anyway, let's get back. Uh, this is a review of Windows 8 top apps. And I've done a couple other episodes, or at least one other episode. And today we're going to jump into the Metro screen, and we're going to look at those top apps. So those top apps are going to be Metro Twit, Toolbox, and this is called Cheats. What is it? Let's see if it highlights it again. Cheats, Keys, and Tips. So any of these apps, you can go to your store, and once in the store, you just type search and hit search, or type in the name of the, so like, for example, for Metro Twit, you'd click on store. You just start typing Metro Twit, and there it is, right there in the list. And you can just click on that and install. So let's go ahead and go back to the screen. We're gonna go ahead and jump right into the Metro Twit. So right on the right off the bat, it's gonna ask you to log in. You're gonna just log in with your Twitter email address or user login. And if you don't have one, you'll have to go sign up for one. If you look on the left hand side, you're going to have these column tiles. Uh, looks a lot like your Windows UI or Metro UI. And the first one's going to be your timeline, so it's just your normal timeline. The second one's going to be your app mentions, so people that mention you, and direct messages. So once you're in here, you can see uh, that you have another view pane over here on the far right hand corner. So what we're going to do is we're just going to grab, let's say, mentions. We're going to right click our uh, left click drag it over and drop it in now I can see all my mentions if you notice I have a uh, I talked to El Presador a lot if you guys like football uh, rage video gaming uh, rage quits lots of screaming Twitter spam and NFL check him out he's hilarious probably one of the funniest guys on YouTube I mean on uh, Twitter and yeah, I guess YouTube too I like him he's pretty funny anyway uh, let's continue on. So once you've had that pin the way you want to, you can view things over there. But let's say you want to add more options over here. You can right click and down here in the bottom right hand corner, manage views. Now you can add things like your favorites or your tweets. So let's go ahead and add those and check it out. So now let's say I want to look at my timeline, but I also want to look at my tweets. If I just left click, drag and drop, there we go. Now I can see all my tweets over here. So let's go ahead and remove that. But let's say I want to follow somebody in particular, like well, let's say El Presador. So what we're going to do is we're going to go right click, we're going to left click on the manage views. Now we're going to type under this user. We're going to type in at the no space underscore El Presador. And then we're going to hit the plus sign. And now he's on the list. Now I can uncheck him or I can check him. Once I check him, he'll be in the list over here. But, okay, I have my timeline. Let's say I want to drag this over here. Now I can see his Twitter feed while seeing my timeline. So uh, that's pretty nice if you're wanting to follow somebody in particular. Let's say, for example, Machinima. So let's go ahead and um, look at it. Let's say you're following Machinima and they're doing a giveaway. You can create a tile icon and then drag that tile icon over to here. And then you can see their feeds as they're going. So that way you can keep up to date, maybe win something. It's a pretty unique tool. So now let's go back to our Metro screen. Once in the Metro screen, you'll see we have Toolbox and Sharing Pane. Let's jump into the Toolbox. Toolbox is a pretty new, uh, a pretty cool app. It has top apps uh, such as your Web Calculator Converter, Tool Depot, which uh, you can go find new tools. But what is this app? This app is a app where you can multitask so let's say you want to open up your calculator but let's say you want to do some other things while you're doing that so let's go to right click and let's change the view to 2 once in the view 2 we can then click calculator and then we can then click how about converter so now you can calculate things and convert things all in one view now what you'll notice is right off the bat is there are pre-done um, how would you put it? Tool sets is I guess what it's called. So let's open the first one, World Travel. So on the World Travel I, um, tool set, you have clocks, you have weather of different areas. And then let's go ahead and go back uh, or change the view. 
So now, how about lunch break? In the lunch break, you can now uh, look at your web. So it loaded Reddit. So if you like to search on Reddit, you can jump into there. Or it has YouTube, Facebook, and your clock. So pretty simple. So it's a pretty cool tool. I like it really well. I uh, have been using it a little bit here and there. And uh, if you guys like it, just look it up Toolbox. The last one is just kind of a spotlight app. It's called Cheats, Cheat Keys and Tips. So we're going to go ahead and click into it. Now you can see in here we've got a lot of cool different things. Uh, basically it doesn't do anything per se, but what it does do is it tells you how to do stuff. So for example, the Windows C button opens up your charms window. If you don't know what your charms window, if you come up here to the top and you drag down, this would be your charms window. So if I hit Windows button and C, it'll pop out. So that's pretty cool. One of the things I did learn from here is let's go find it real quick name tile group if you're kind of a a organization freak like me you might like this so it says are you seriously organized you can name your tile groups on the start screen click the minus in the lower right corner of the screen to get the zoomed out view of your tiles and then right click on the tile group on the bottom bar choose this symbol the pen symbol name group and then it talks about using it on a touch screen so let's go ahead and try that out so we'll go back to our start screen we will then hit the minus key in the right corner now we're looking at the views so as you noticed I've named this app right here this group right here so it's top windows 8 apps episode 2 so let's say I want to name my first group we're gonna click this icon down here we're gonna right click we're gonna highlight the group right click and then name that group so we're just going to name that, um, I don't know, main group. Now you may or may not want to name your groups, but I just thought it was an interesting uh, tool. So main group. So now if I click down here, main group, top Windows 8 apps. And let's go ahead and name this center one. So right click, name group. Name this group. We're going to say favorite apps there we go now we've named our groups pretty simple so that's the sharing our cheats keys and tips hope you guys liked the top apps this week if you guys have any apps that you want me to review you want me to check out and share with you guys what I found what I've learned or things I like just uh, submit them in the comments below if you guys like this video make sure you hit the thumbs up the like and the share please please share the video if you like it it really helps me out and uh, Hope to catch you guys next time, so thanks for stopping by.